Hello, 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 and welcome to episode 38, I believe it is, of my Let's Play of Aurora 4X. Now, um, we're starting this uh, episode with a very quick update to tell you that um, Catherine Taylor has completed her research into Ordnance Production 12 bit points and is now researching mi missile agil agility 32 um, per missile size point. So, that's nice to know. So I'm going to let some more time pass, and when something interesting happens, I'll be back. So, back in a bit. And Morgan AG has added another 2,000 tons of capacity. So let's have a look at them. 2,000 tons of capacity, for slip where that is. They are currently at um, 8,000 tons of capacity per slipway. So we'll want to add, um, I believe, 1,000 tons of capacity more for our censorship. Let's have a quick look at our censorship. The tow hatcher, I believe it was. Yes, tow hatcher. Oh, it's actually 9,200 tons. So after this, we'll want to add another 200 tons of capacity more. So I'm going to let some more time pass. And well, actually, I'm going to have a look at the geranium situation. Because, well, it's actually um, stabilizing a bit. Because I believe we were at 333,300 last time, and now we're at 33,800. So it's gone up a tiny amount and well but it still says it's at negative 72 um, reason to be so um let's have a look do we have any more auto mines on earth yes we have seven more so what we're going to do is we're going to tell them to move five more automated mines over here to Faye so that it gets up to 50. No, 60, I mean. So, I'm going to let some more time pass, and when something interesting happens, I'll be back. So, back in a bit. And we have our first uh, laser attack coming in. Um, the infrared laser has been researched by Joseph Winter, and he's currently researching the 10 centimeter laser focal size on Earth. So, I am. Um, it's really just only that in this quick update, so I'm going to let some more time pass, and when something interesting happens, I'll be back. So, back in a bit. Okay then, so a couple of things have happened. First of all, our uh, shipyard, Morgan AG, has added 10,000 or 1,000 tons of capacity per slipway. So let's have a look at them. Now they're 9,000 tons, so we'll want to add this much again, so that'll be at above uh, 9,200, 9,200, so that we can start making our sensor ships over there. Another thing that happened we just go to our log again, is that we finished uh, the research into expanded civilian economy, 20%. So now everyone will want 20% more stuff, so our, our trade, our uh, civilians should have 20% more things to do, which is always nice. So, um, what am I going to do now? Well, I'm going to get our new research going. We have five research labs that we're going to put into construction and production to make um, what's underground ex excavation allows the construction of underground infrastructure what is that? I don't know but we want mining production because well yes well actually we want yes mining production and then more civilian economy so you there, Mr. Metcalfe. You can have 60 labs. Holy mother of something. Um, Mr. Metcalfe. You're also going to do this one. So, Q. And also the um, shipyard operations. It's also going to be cute. And I suppose that we can also. Um, Yes, more fuel production would also be nice to have. So, now that we've got those queued, I'm going to let my time pass. And when something interesting happens, I'll be back. So, back in a bit. Okay, so we have added the last bit of uh, capacity to Morgan AG on Earth. So, let's have a look. Manage shipyards. Morgan AG, now we can retool for the 
Uh, sensor platform, tow hater. Set activity, there you go. And now we can start, can start making them, and they'll take a year to make. A little under a year, actually. So, long time. So what we're going to do, is so we're going to add an extra slipway over here, I think. Yes. And then I'm going to let some more time pass, and when something interesting happens, I'll be back. So, back in a bit. Okay then, so, another research is done. And uh, this time it is uh, by Toby Raymond in the jump point theory. So now that that's done, I will have to start looking into um, how to do jump points and stuff. Because I don't know anything about that. So, um, I'm going to let some more time pass. And with something interesting happens, I'll be back. So, back in a bit. And a couple more things have happened. Another research is done. This time it is by Catherine Taylor into the missile agility um, of 23 per missile size points. So, of 32, I mean, not 23 per missile size points. So, let's have a look because she's not doing anything now. So, missiles and kinetic weapons. You there, Catherine Taylor. You have to do some more things. Um, you can start doing that research. Yes, missiles and kinetics, and missile launch uh, reload rate three. Um, you can be cute. And also missile agility can be cute. Magazine feed system efficiency. Machine ejection system very important. Better warheads. All very important things I think. Things I think. So those can all be cute. And I think well let's have a quick look at if something something else has happened. Yes. The supply of corundium on Earth is done. So let's have a quick look how much corundium we're using. using. Ooh, we yeah, I've got 45,000 of it, but we are using um, projected usage is 49,000. So we actually need to get some corundium, more corundium mines going ASAP. So let's have a quick look. If we've got al any colonies making corundium, you there, you're making a thousand, a thousand geranium a year. That's very nice for Earth. Actually, as you can see, the recent SP has gone down to a negative, or gone up to negative 63. So that's very nice, and the stockpile is actually rising. However, corundium, well, do we have any? Um, um, any uh, colonies that have them? Luna doesn't have it. Does Mars have it? No. Io? No. Well, I haven't looked. Yes, Io does have it. So Io is a very big priority to get more mines going because it's got and it's got geranium and corundium. So very important to get some mines going on Io. Let's have a look. Io, you have available workers actually. That's pretty nice. So what we're actually going to do is on IO. Yes, IO, you are going to demand uh, 50 more uh, mines, normal mines. There you go, add contract. And Earth is going to be supplying those normal mines. Contract to IO, right? Yep, there you go. And do we have any automated mines on Earth? Yes, we have 11, so we're going to move them to Fey. So, um... Uh, supply 10 automated mines at contract, and Fey are going to demand 10 automated mines. So that we can get this done as soon as possible, and then when this uh, mining colony is done, we'll just have the civilians move every everything to the next. And then onwards and onwards and onwards. 
so um well actually let's have a look if we have any um possible colonies with uh, high amounts of corundium um not that window this one no not that window this one there you go here it is uh corun corundium 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 there are only a couple of places with corundium actually Hmm. Ganymede. Ganymede. Ganymede has a lot of corundium on it, but with a very low accessibility, which is very sad. And we have already done a geological surface survey. Survey. Geo survey. How is the atmospheric pressure going? Oh, oxygen is almost done. We're almost at one atmospheric pressure of oxygen. And then after that, um, we'll probably add some carbon dioxide. Probably bring the carbon dioxide up to, well, let's first say to one atmospheric pressure, and then we'll have a look if we need to put more carbon dioxide in, because we also need to raise the surface temperature to, well, <laughs> at least be positive. And um, yes, so we're going to wait until we get 0.1 atmospheric pressure of uh, oxygen, and once we've got that, we'll start looking into raising carbon dioxide or nitrogen. So, I'm going to let some more time pass, and when something interesting happens, I'll be back. So, back in a bit. And we've got another new research lab, so let's add it to... Um, to the laser guy, I think, yes. And research lab. So, and we're going to let some more time pass, and when something interesting happens, I'll be back. Back in a bit. And something else has happened. Another research has been done, this time by Toby Raymond. Uh, and he's completed his research into minimum engine power modifier o times 0.4. And he's now researching reactor power boost 5%, explosion 7% on Earth. So yes, that's nice. Um, and with that, I think that we're going to end this episode here. But actually, let's first um, get a look at uh, IO, because I believe that we were moving some more mines over there. Uh, yes. But they're still doing that or something? I don't know. How many mines do we have there? 58. 50, 50. And on Callisto we also have 50. So, um... But yes, and how is Mars going with the, um... Air thing? Ooh, they're almost there. 98% there. So, uh, I'm going to let some time pass between this episode and next. And I hope to see you in episode 39, I believe, the next one is. So, goodbye.